Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I promise this is the last video I'm doing in this blouse, but I'm really feeling it, I must say, so I just want to use it up and buy, you know? <laughs> okay, so I have a very fun and important video for you today, which is safe blind buys. Some might say there is nothing safe with blind buying, but there are some fragrances that are just likable. They are just generally likable. I'm not gonna talk about longevity here too much. I'm just gonna talk about likable scents that basically everyone, almost everyone would appreciate and like. There is nothing obnoxious about them or they're just perfect to mix uh, or they have ingredients that are very much likable. So let's start. The first one I wanna show you is one of the Killians that is actually a great safe blind buy which doesn't happen often with Killian. And this is Liaison's Dangerous Typical Me. So this is my favorite peach fragrance. There's peach, plum, coconut in here, some rose, cinnamon, sandalwood, musk, oak musk. So much in here is happening. Vanilla in the dry down. But in general, this is a very beautiful, soft, feminine fragrance. I know some men wear it as well, but I love it on me. Um, not really on men. So yeah, you get that beautiful plum peach coconut in the beginning. Then it gets a little bit more floral because of that rose, but it's a very soft rose. Nothing prominent on rose in here. And in the dry down, it's very vanilla, woody, oak messy. I love it. And also there is umbrette in the heart as well, which give the middle of the perfume that resiny, fruity vibe. I love it. Laison Dangereux, the safest Killian, I feel like. Okay, now we're gonna talk about the safest Muggler. And this is Alien or Extraordinaire. And this is really, I'm serious, really the safest Muggler you can get. Uh, safer than Alien, safer than anything. I mean the original. So this is a flanker I've been in love with for years now. And this is a very citrusy, light take on the original. But it is very, very far from Eau de Parfum. And even though this is Eau de Toilette, this lasts so, so, so well, guys. Perfect lasting power. It lasts all day on the skin, on clothes even more. I just adore this. Uh, it's very zesty. Uh, it, you still get that beautiful amber and beautiful jasmine that Alien has, but without that potency uh, and everything is blended with beautiful, f f not fruits, citruses basically. So I love it. I really, really love it. And I really, truly believe that this is the safest Alien or safest Mugler even on the market. So that's El Extraordinaire. Okay, uh, now we're going to talk about Chanel. And as much as Coco Mademoiselle could be on this list, I don't feel like that many people love it, even though it's very popular for years and years. I feel like this one is better of a safe blind buy. And this is Chanel Chance of Fresh. Uh, so this is the yellow liquid. First of all, out of all the Chance flankers and the original, this one is the longest lasting. Perfect longevity, great ciliage, people can smell you, even though it's an old toilet. Great when it comes to that. Uh, it is a very sparkling fragrance, very citrusy again. Uh, it can definitely be a unisex. Um, I love it for gym. It's like a very good gym fragrance, but uh, you can still wear it during the daytime for work, for evenings. I love it for summer evenings as well, because it has some sexiness to it. I really, really like it, and I feel like this, out of all the Chanel's, again, this is the safest line buy, because it's very likable in general. So, Chanel Chanson Fresh. All right, now from Tom Ford's, I also have a safe line buy, surprise, surprise. And this is from the Private Blend, and this is all the Soleil Blanc. I feel like everybody likes it. It's soft, scent and lotion with a bit of citruses, a bit of peppery. <sighs> just beautiful coconut uh, and it has that um, I used to say this a lot it has that piney uh, pine wood vibe to it as well so it's a little bit woody I really really like it. it's very refreshing but yet it's super bougie so you're gonna smell like money in summer when you wear this 
uh, yeah, it's bougie by the pool kind of fragrance, you know, really, really like it. And again, very safe of a blind buy. You cannot go wrong with it because it's just so intoxicating, but at the same time, it's not as potent. Very good. And a crowd pleaser and men love it too. Okay, now we're going to talk about something very potent, so other side of the spectrum, but again, a safe blind buy, in my opinion. Dolce Gabbana, the one, intense. Beautiful black bottle, uh, one of my definite favorites this year. I think it's going to be on my best buys of 2020, I feel like, just a hint, hint. Um, this is a beautiful creamy coconut mixed with woody notes and... Uh, very alienic jasmine. I love it. It's gorgeous and again, it's very likable. Men adore it. It's classy, but it's sexy. It's creamy, potent. It's everything. They did such a good job with this, guys. I, I like it the most out of all the, the only one ranges because the other ones are just too generic for me. This one is great. So the only one intense, great safe blind buy of mine, I must say. Another one. Ah, uh, this has to be on the list. Kayali Vanilla. You cannot go wrong with a good vanilla and this is one of the best ones. Simple as that. One of the best vanillas that are on the market, especially from designer niche range. To me, Kayali is kind of in the middle between designer and niche, if you know what I mean. They're perfect mixing scents. So if, even if you don't like it on its own, which is very weird because it's like vanilla, you know what I mean? <laughs> Maybe you just don't like vanilla, that I understand. But anyways, um, even if you don't appreciate on its own, you're gonna just mix it and it's gonna be mixed beautifully. I mix it with so many things, guys, you have no idea. And look how much dent I already made, considering how many perfumes I have. I love this fragrance. It's a very oriental vanilla, very sweet, very um, caramelly. Beautiful. Love that one. Great safe blind buy. Okay, now very, very light fragrances. And I feel like no matter what you get from that range, you're going to be fine. Uh, they're not very long lasting, but they're beautiful. They're just beautiful. And I'm talking about Aqua Allegoria range. This is Tesura and this is Limon Verde. I love all of them, guys. I love all Aqua Allegorias. I don't have more just because I know how not long-lasting they are, if you know what I mean. But these ones I just have to have in my collection, no matter what. Tazura, I love it. This is a beautiful jasmine with tea and vanilla in the dry down. Oh, guys, just beautiful. And actually, um, I first sniffed it on my friend on vacation. And she smelled so strong with this. So probably people can smell you even when you cannot smell yourself with this one. It's not as bad with longevity. It's like four hours. Okay, it's so bad, but not as bad. You know what I mean? The scent is beautiful. One of the most beautiful scents. So safe blind buy, guys. Safe blind buy. And same with Limon Verde if you like uh, the lime scent, if you like sugary citruses. It's quite green. Beautiful. I love really so many. Um, Pampeluna, which is a grapefruit one. Passiflora, uh, Bergamote Calabria. There are so many so beautiful. So Aquilagoras are in general great safe blind buys and I feel like they're a great gift because their bottles are so gorgeous and so classy. Okay, I have one, two, three more. Uh, so this is going to be controversial in the comments. I am aware of that, but to me, it is the same blind buy. And this is Poison Girl Eau de Parfum by Dior. This is one of the sexiest scents I own. It's intoxicating, it's sweet, but very oriental. You still get some almonds here, a lot of tonka, a lot of rose, very vanilla, like a naughty sister of hypnotic poison, you know? So if you are in the same vibe when it comes to perfumes as me, you're gonna love this. So great safe blind buy if you follow me. You know what I mean? Yeah. Okay. Uh, next safe blind buy is Chloe Nomad um, La Absolute de Parfum. And this is definitely more long lasting than the original. And you get more of that beautiful uh, vetiver and mirable plum in it. It's just done to perfection. 
beautiful, um, quite sweet, but not too sweet. It's a very toned down fragrance, uh, but it has its own potency. It's beautiful for summer, beautiful for autumn that we have now. I love it. I just adore this fragrance and I feel like it's so likable. It's very unlikely that you might not like it. You know what I mean? Even if you, if it's not your favorite, you will still probably be okay with it. Mirable Plum, I love. I've been looking for a great Mirable Plum fragrance for, a, for the longest time. And I finally got one. And this one is going to stay in my collection for a long, long time. I'm going to repurchase and repurchase. Because it's, it's just my easy grab, you know? This is a perfume that I grab when I don't know what to wear. Or when I grab when I'm just running errands. Or I grab when I'm just heading out to lunch or dinner. This is just a perfect all-rounder. Not too sexy, not too feminine, not too citrusy or sporty. It's just a very neutral fragrance. Love it. And I love the bottle. And last but not least, we have a vanilla. And this is Yves Saint Laurent um, Manifesto. And this is the original Eau de Parfum. This is one of the most calming, beautiful, sensual vanillas that I own. It is quite green. It has um, some berries in the top. Beautiful fragrance. And if you're hearing some, it's the cat eating. He decided to have dinner right by me, right there, um, and do it now. Sorry, I I actually wanted to get him out from the bowl, but my boyfriend forbid me. So we're gonna deal with it. Uh, anyways, this is perfect. I love it. Perfect, beautiful blind buy. I blind bought it myself just like as many others here uh, but this one I feel like it was the best shot you know because it's just so classy and so so likable you can wear it anytime anywhere perfect perfume so that's manifesto and that's it guys I hope you enjoyed it I hope this video helped you if you feel like there is another blind buy that is very safe and very likable Please leave a comment down below and see you guys in the next video. Please don't forget to subscribe, hit the notification bell, follow me on Instagram as usual. Love you.